look at the celluloid and vertical. So, you think of using that? That's 416.5. shows that we are close. Our, our derivation there uh, was not well. Uh, well. We could have done a sum to the moment line and a few of those two variables. So right now, if I right click on this, that's F section 1. So let's go to F section 1 and see what it is. It's just the default of Saffacine. So you have to use that. Now 
now let's do the opposite. Like let's make the cross section area much smaller and see if we get like three nine or something. So it looks like as we go up on the cross section area, we are approaching uh, the same result. Before we do that, let's look at the moment diagram. Moment three three. like there's a moment uh, in the middle because all of the moments are zero, right? At least the cross section is zero. So if you right click on a member, you see the moment 0 0.03 gets reached. So it's approaching a zero moment on the other side. It's just scaling up relative to zero. Okay, so that's correct. Um, to unlock it. Oh, we should look at the actual thing. We'll do that in a second. Find transform properties, train transform, modify. Now instead of 100, what do you say? So zero, zero, 001. Okay. Let's see what the train score looks like. soft and compressed and performing and, and its performing number is faintly monitored with elements, right? And all these um, Schrodinger constraints. And that's the difference between static to determine and static to determine. The three train arc under Schrodinger load has to be out of compression. Right? And based on static, so I'm going Okay. Uh, going. Yeah. So a big difference. Look at that. 290 chips for us. So it is dependent on the axial. It's not very dependent. Put in the regular or just reasonable or just a normal cross section area, it was almost the same. It's actually directly proportional to the right? So these are 416, 0.5, and 0.6 percent right? So the reaction rate of the actual deformation has something to do with it, but clearly it wasn't that important. But under the two point load offset, so it'll be interesting to see how important it is here. So you guys can play with that. See what scale and how it's coming out to me. Take a little more. Oh, we'll get this happy. Okay. Oh, yeah, it performed actually. Okay. Any questions? So we have something to think about. Okay. Let's play. 